Hello there. April is getting off pretty much to where March left off on the rather cloudy and damp theme for many of us. We've got this lingering occluded front that's been persisting across southwest England, Wales and certainly into Northern Ireland first part of this morning, bringing a band of rain heavy in places and has caught a caused a bit of localised flooding. Elsewhere, there is some rain wanting to push its way into eastern coastal areas, but actually parts of northwest England up into northern Scotland actually seeing some brighter skies first thing. And it's the Northern Isles where we'll hold on to the best of the sunshine throughout the rest of the day. The rain in the west will gradually ease out, but it is going to continue on and off throughout the day. Further spots of drizzle want to push into areas of Lincolnshire and Yorkshire thanks to an easterly breeze off the North Sea and in that breeze it is going to feel quite chilly here. Coastal areas of England and Scotland not seeing much higher than 7, 8 or 9 degrees Celsius. Areas more towards the west will be slightly milder, highs of 13 or 14 degrees across Wales and southwest England. Into this evening, the rain will continue to ease off across Northern Ireland, but probably push more now into parts of Western Scotland, and generally Western areas will hold onto the cloud throughout the night. In the east, though, we start to feed in some drier air from Scandinavia, and that's just going to allow the cloud to break up a bit more, parts of Aberdeenshire, Northumberland, down into North Yorkshire. So underneath those clearer skies, temperatures will drop off a bit more here, lows of 2 degrees across Aberdeen, 3 degrees for parts of Newcastle, but holding up a bit more elsewhere underneath that cloud. It's into Sunday where we'll see more significant changes in our weather and that is thanks to high pressure that is wanting to build its way in and that will help settle things down. Our winds will ease out and it's also going to help decay that occluded front away. For the start of Sunday, there will still be some outbreaks of rain for parts of Scotland into eastern coasts of Northern Ireland and can't rule out the odd spot of rain for Wales and southwest England throughout the day as well. But for southern Scotland, central eastern areas of England, the cloud is going to continue to break up and Sunday is looking like a pretty fine day to be out and about with a lot of good prolonged sunshine. Temperatures are still slightly cool when you're directly on that eastern coastal areas between 8 to 9, but still pushing towards 10 degrees now we've got that sunshine in place, but still slightly milder as you head further inland and towards the west. As we move into the evening, the cloud is going to continue to break up even more and we will see a persistent number of clear intervals during the night. That's just going to allow temperatures to drop off more widely though and so we'll see a more widespread frost develop come the first part of Monday morning and we'll see some further chilly nights as we head throughout the new working week as well. For some of us though it's not going to be a working week because it is the start of the Easter holidays and thankfully it is going to be fine and bright for many of us. Areas in the north and west though do just need to watch out for some rain that will want to push its way in more towards the middle part of the week but in the south and east, you are looking to stay relatively dry throughout much of the week. Do keep up to date with the full forecast though, and you can do that by following us on all of our social media channels. If you're watching on YouTube, then do make sure to subscribe as well, and we'll see you again here shortly. Bye-bye.